Hello, Sandy MacDonald here and I'm on my Why You Must Blog Facebook business fan page. I'm going to show you how I made the welcome page. First of all, I created the small advertisement in order to encourage people to click the like button and also to incorporate a photograph. Because I had used the logo, I thought it important that there was a human presence for this site. Um, if you're not able to create something similar to this yourself, just go to odesk or elance.com and um, it, it really would not be costly or difficult for you to create a small advertisement such as this. Once you've got the image, I uploaded my image to my Why You Must Blog site. Uh, you could upload it to Flickr if you didn't have a blog. But the key thing you're looking to do is to create a URL address for the image. So I will post the code that created this whole advertisement to my Why You Must Blog site. And then all you'll need to do is change the size and color, which I'll indicate to you how you do that. I have also linked this image to my blog. And um, that means that, uh, which you can do, which I think is really important, that you make that connection between your blog and your Facebook business page. Okay, so how did I actually make the page? Well, I went to edit page under your image and clicked on that. And down here uh, in this menu, I clicked on applications. Now, I didn't actually have the Welcome FBML application, which is the one that you'll be looking for. I had to search for it, but that's what you're going to be looking for, the uh, Facebook FBML application. Okay, so having found it, you go to the application. Now, you'll see that there's a, a box and a box title and a box here to put your code in, which I've already got the code for my welcome page. But in your case, so I'm just going to add another FBML box. And then it's not very intuitive, but what you have to do is go back to your page and then back to edit page and then back to applications and you'll see here that I have an FBML, FBML box. If you then click on go to applications, you have now an empty box. You will obviously key in welcome here, and then you will paste your code in here, uh, and save the changes, and you will end up with your welcome page on the home page, the same way that I have here. Now you need to set your welcome page to the default page that visitors will find you on and you do that by going to edit page and manage permissions and down here on the default landing tab, tab you can set welcome. Okay so this is what the Facebook welcome page code will look like. Uh, this line here is uh, pointing Facebook to the URL destinations for your website and for the image address, URL address for the advertisement that you've created. That's assuming that you've uploaded it to something like uh, Flickr or your website. You will have a URL address for it. So if you replace that with your website and that with your image address, then that image will link through to your website. This is just the code to indicate the size and type of, of the entire advert and this is the code that indicates the size of the headline. So this would, you'll replace this with your headline and you can make that bigger or smaller uh, at this point. The color here can be changed and I've given you a link where you can go and select a different color if you don't want the green. Uh, this here is the code for the, par uh, the next paragraph and um, 
it also includes a link to your website. So if you were to write your text with a link to your website, you would use this code here and replace that with your website name. Paragraph 1, 2 and 3, and obviously you might only have one paragraph. And then finally, the code for your closing line, and again you can change the size there and the color there. I hope that's been helpful for you to get up uh, an image and code for your Facebook welcome pack. If you found that useful, um, I'd appreciate your feedback. And please subscribe to How to Blog. Um, I regularly send out tips, techniques and information that I've uh, gained along the road of blogging, uh, all about how to help you connect and relate to your online community. Bye.